like your dog's gone falsetto when you run through. I guess he's learning to croon. <laughs> hey, boy. What's the idea of bringing a lady in a man's dressing room? And a Park <laughs> Avenue dang too. Smell <laughs> <laughs> that perfume. Roofing. Roofing. Boy, oh boy, what an eyeful. Here, Roofing. Let me have that miniature hound. Me? Oh, I'll take that. Hey, hey, Thank you, boys. I want to thank you for uh, Miss... Uh... Yes. Yes. And she'll remember you in her prayers tonight. Thank you. Oh, no, no, no. Uh, she insists on a police escort. That guy Renfrew burns me. Me too. What's he got that I haven't got? The girl. <laughs> Oh, your dog's hurt. Only his feelings. He craves attention. He is a different paw this time. <laughs> Go on home, you faker. Oh, she wants me to take her. Oh, no. Uh, out. I mean, I mean, oh, yes. Miss Larkin. Oh, Miss Larkin. There's a messenger here from your father. Oh, thank you. You'll excuse me? What were you doing with that mountain? What were you saying to him? Please. Sorry, I... I don't see what business that is of yours. You didn't mention your father's name to him, did you? Of course not. Why? Has anything happened to Dad? No. He sent this messenger from Gru's Landing to tell us to go back to Toronto. He's changed his plans. But I don't understand. Dad asked Mr. Williams and me to meet him here. Your father, he had big deal on don't want Mounties to know. They always stick their noses in everybody's... Well, why didn't Dad telephone me here? Have big storms up there. Wires all down. I think she don't believe us. How long will it take Bennett to clear that stuff? There's no time. Larkin makes a prize visit. Find Bennett is robbing him. Shipping you best first. Mm, Bennett's not going to let Larkin expose us all, is he? He'll take care of Larkin if Mounties kept away. Come on, you better hurry. All right, you keep watching there. Here he comes. Not bad, boys. Saves me taking a bath. 